Hello guys, this is Esports 16. Welcome back to Let's Play Donkey Kong Country 2: Diddy's Conquest. Today we're gonna start War 3. Con let's see, what's the name of this level? Oh, uh, Crim Quay. Qua excuse me. And uh, let's go get started. Our first level is Barrel Bayou. Now this is the swamp level of this. Uh, this is the swamp world of this game. Oh, yeah, that barrel was supposed to take out all those rats right there, but. Now here's the main gimmick of this level. You see these little barrels right here. You can move it into any direction you want. But keep in mind, there's a timer right there. And the timer will decrease, and once it hits zero, the cannon will fire off. In whatever direction you have. It doesn't matter if it's in a good spot or a bad spot. And these cloaks right here, they will throw stuff at you. Some of it good, most, but most of it is bad. So, so yeah. But we have to pay attention to one of those cloaks later on, you'll see why. And, uh... Actually, I need to go over here because we need Rambi. Now, it's very important that you hang on to Rambi until we get to the, uh, the No Animal Buddy sign. And you'll see why here. And yes, Rambi cannot take out those cloaks, unfortunately. And yes, most of these, these cans will have two seconds on the thing there, but you should have plenty enough time to get in the direction you want it to go before the, uh, before the timer expires. Yeah, Cloak will, uh, throw bananas. Now, sometimes they'll go into a direction over here, like, uh, to the right or whatever. So keep an eye on him. And yeah, some of these will be moving up. And, well, shoot, I didn't uh, jump right there. And yes, that cannon will be of an importance later. Actually, here in just a minute, actually. Ah, oh, shoot. I go back and get Rambi. Hang on. There's the cannon right there, and I'm about down to zero lives. Wow. Yeah, I, I had to fight uh, Cleaver again. And it took a couple lives out of me, so. And you know what? I'll come back and get Rambi later at the end of the level or something. Okay, um, we should be close to a cloak. Ah, shoot. Lost Dixie. Yeah, right here is where you need a Rambi, and that's how you get the hero coin. You need to have Rambi, you need to have Rambi until you get to this sign, and that's how you get the hero coin. Now, after this sign, there's an arrow of pointing bananas right here. This cloak will throw barrels at at a, at you. Now you need to you need to follow him, but you gotta stay close to him because he'll actually throw a chest down, which has the cannonball, and we need that cannonball to get into this bonus area. So yes, that's how you get to the first bonus area of this uh of this level. And we gotta destroy them all. Basically, we gotta use the use the cannonball to destroy the two dragonflies and that zinger. But Dixie makes this thing a lot, a lot easier. But it doesn't matter. It's very, e very easy mini game. Speaking of Dixie, we got her back. Now watch for this. Uh, now watch these arrow cannons right there. They will automatically fire in that direction. That one had the. That one has the end. Or the yeah, the end. That nah, missed the O. Yeah, be careful right here because that barrel will actually make fire you, fire you into the zinger if you don't move the control stick in the opposite direction. Like if it's pointing left, you go right and so on. Oh my god, I really do hate these guys. There's a level later on in this uh, in this uh, world that those guys can be absolute dicks. I mean, seriously. Oh god, that fell in. Okay. Wait till this guy gets out of the way. Yes, watch out. He'll throw a zinger last and then he'll get out of your way. And actually, Dixie's actually a good choice for this level. Oh boy, this part right here. Now, you have to time the, uh... You, you actually blast out the barrel here. No matter what. Because it's the one the point arrows up if it comes back. Okay, there it is. Now you gotta keep moving with the barrel here. I mean, it means you gotta move the left. You gotta move the control the uh, control stick in time with the barrel. I guess you could say. And there's the bonus. And there's the last bonus area actually. Make sure you got you gotta have your second Kong teammate with you because you gotta do the team up thing. 
Okay, find the token. Okay, we're going to use these barrel cannons again. The uh, timed controlled uh, barrel cannons, I guess is what they're called. And yes, they all have two seconds, so you need to be quick and plus plus you're on time limit to get the uh, the Krim coin. They're actually called Krim, Krim coins. I know I called them uh, Club of Coins. Dang it. Stupid zinger. Ah, uh, about got an extra life anyway. Okay, so there we go. Um, that's the level complete, but I'm going to need to come back here and get the hero coin. So, I'll meet you guys until I get the uh, hero coin. So, so yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, there you go. That's how you get the hero coin for, uh, for Barrel Bayou. You just gotta make sure you get Raimi to the uh, no Raimi sign, and that's how you get the hero coin. Okay, but unfortunately, by doing this off camera, I got a game over and had to redo the Cleaver boss battle, and so that means I have to redo this whole level. So I'm gonna redo this whole level, guys, and I'm gonna meet you guys for the next level. So be right back. Alrighty, guys. So there we go. That that's uh, Barrel Value fully completed. Now we move on to the next level, Glimmer's Galleon. Now this level right here ha is a water level, but as you can tell, it is freaking dark. But we have an animal buddy that will actually help us out. I gotta find him first, and then I gotta go back because there's a bonus game. There's a bonus area here, as well as the hero coin. There he is. This is Glimmer, the anglerfish. Now he'll have a uh, spotlight, like a little angler, that little light thing, like most anglerfishes do. So he'll actually help you see through the levels, which is pretty good. Okay, is there only one bonus area, or is there two? No, there's two. Okay. Um, also, right here at the beginning is the hero coin. I just need a. See, I'm trying to figure out how to get to it. I remember I just found the hit my, no, my pra excuse me, on my practice file, I found this uh, area by luck, the hero coin. Ah, oh, shoot. Hmm. Okay, I need to go straight up. I didn't know that. Yeah, from where you start. Which is right here, and think we there's another bonus area right here. Okay, we need to go straight up. There's the bonus area area right there, but I'm gonna ignore that for right now. Cause let's see, can you Yeah, if you go all the way over here from where the bonus area is. See a bunch of bananas here, like a little secret. Get some extra lives. If you go up, there's the hero coin. And some bananas as well. Okay, so there we go. Um, you may notice I'm, I'm a hero coin short. It's because I did not do the uh, the Lost World level from for Clover. Like I said, I'm going to do that to the end of the game. So, okay, so here is the bonus area right here, the first one. Uh, find the token, which is in that little open air way right there. And unfortunately, we do not have Glimmer. Okay, so we gotta navigate our way through this maze without Glimmer, of course. Okay. Now this one can be kind of tricky because you can get lost very easily here. Well, kinda. At first, when you're first playing through this uh, bonus game, it's can be kind of tricky, but not for that. Okay, so uh, okay. Uh, let's move on here. Now we can actually move on to level. We won't see the next bonus area for for at least a little while. Oh, I thought that was an enemy there, but no, it's just glimmer. So yeah, okay. So yeah, these arrow shaped bananas will actually point you the way to uh, through the level. So that's pretty nice. And yes, we got the normal mental rays, and we have Lockjaw. God, I hate that dude. I mean, I seriously do. There's the K. Try to get some Kong letters here, but they're gonna be kind of difficult to find. I forgot about that guy right there, and I about ran into him. 
Yeah, you gotta be very, very careful to make sure you don't run to any enemies where you lose your Kong or die. Okay, pointing up. I gotta watch out for that. Ooh, well, no, 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 no. What the frig is that? There he is. Down there. Stupid fish. Okay, you have about three seconds whenever he does that to get the frig out of his way. Uh, there's some, there's a, there's a, uh, Banana coin and some banana bunches over there. I don't worry about it. Yeah! Yeah. Yeah, I lost Dixie. Let's see here. There's the O. I want to let those uh, guys pass by. Okay, there's got to be a way to get this O. Whoa, no, no, whoa, that was close. I about died. I thought I, thought I was going to die right there. Oh, yeah, watch out for this guy right here, this puff fish. Whenever he explodes, he'll send shrapnels of those little, of his needle, of those needles from his body. So make sure you avoid that, because that will hurt. Big time. Okay. Um, I gotta get past this freaking butthole right here. Okay. Okay. Okay, get up, get up there, Diddy. Oh, get, oh, God. oh, my God! Wow, how did I not die right there? Okay, there's the halfway barrel. Okay, I'm looking for the end because that'll give us a way to the next bonus area. Area, excuse me. Oh God, I hate these guys out there too. Those uh, starfish. They would seem like they, they home in on you. Let me go. Oh crud. Okay, watch out. Let's see a few more bananas can get an extra life now. And there's that freaking butthole. There's butthole number two, aka lockjaw. And those starfish. Okay, got an extra life. Oh god, watch out for the shrapnel. I about did not see that. Okay. I'll wait till lockjaw. Uh, oh god, no! Okay, what's, what letter is that? Okay, there's the N. And, uh... Okay, yeah, whenever you find the N, guys, you need to go back. There should be some arrows pointing. Maybe, yeah. Now, for this level right here, you need to take your time. Don't rush through it unless you're speed running. Which I am not. Hmm. Okay, but there's where the end is. Hang on just a moment, guys. Okay, uh, we need to be looking for an arrow pointing to the right. No, get away from me! Wow, I've had a lot of close calls in this stupid level. Okay, maybe it's, uh... Okay. Okay, uh... Oh, shoot, where the hell is it? Looking for an arrow going to the right. Please don't see me. Thank you. That would suck if I got trapped right in there. <laughs> Lock job. Oh no! Oh my god! Stupid starfish. Huh. Hang on here. I was gonna go on. I'm wasting too much time right now. No, oh God! Most guys can be annoying. They're already a, a no nuisance. Oh come on, really? Really, buddy? Fuck y'all! Okay, guys. Well, I think I figured out where I need to go here. You need to keep on going through the level here, and then keep on looking till you see a banana that's pointing to the right here and watch out for all these stupid friggin enemies here oh god yeah cause there's a bunch of starfishes there get away get away get away get away okay so there's the okay go down go down diddy there you go there's the arrow pointing to the right you need to stick to the bottom here I'll wait until this freaking butthole goes away
Okay, right there. Whenever you see the arrows pointing down where that lockjaw is, those bananas, that is the next bonus area. And we gotta find the token here. Another one of these maze levels. Now this is the one right here that I'm thinking of that can be kind of difficult. Yeah, because you can get lost in here very easy. It may take some a couple of tries before you can get there. See, right there's a token, but we need to get to it. That's the key word. Which I did, by the way. Okay, cool. Passed on the first try. Now, all we can do is focus on finishing up this Dagon level. Because we've already had enough shenanigans for one day. And I died. Dang it. Kind of got cornered right there, and I couldn't, there was no way I could have went. But anyways, guys, uh, meet you guys back to where I was. Actually, no, never mind. You know, I'll just keep this in. Screw it. If I die again, I'll cut. Okay, got Dixie with me. Go away. You go away. Look out for the shrapnel and the lockjaw. Yeah, good to go. You know, I want to switch to Dixie for a little while. Why? Because, why not? So now we can just focus on finishing up this level right here. There's no space for error right there. Wait until that to lockjaw goes away. You can swim fast right here, so make sure you have the Y button pressed in. Jump for these. Okay. Okay, down there's the bonus area. Let's see. No, 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 no. Not in my house. Is that what the Kimmy Matumble says or something? Okay, wait for that guy to explode. We got a couple more. We got two lock jaws here. And I'm gonna get bit. Yep. Okay, keep going, keep going, Diddy. Puffer fish. Shoot, hope he doesn't come up here. Yeah, I'm going to barely sneak by. Here we're at the end of the level. Yep, whenever you see this up barrel right there, that means we're at the end of the level. Blasted away on the ship. There we go. Yeah, make sure you watch out for that porcupine right there, Dick. Because he can be a nuisance. Alright, so the next level right here, this one can be kind of a tricky one. I mean, not that tricky, but before we do, actually, let's save over here at the Kong College. Save the game. Alrighty. I will be definitely coming back here before I start one level, because there's one level right here. It's not this one, but I think it's one coming up that's going to be a major pain in the ass. I mean, a big time pain in the ass. I think it's actually the, well, I know it's the next to last level of this world.